I want to explain to you what I do with the process of making a transition to a parapet wall with a half pipe, clay pipes on top. Most of the problems, the problem is this. People tar this, and tar, and more tar, and the tar pulls away and water leaks into this area. So what I need to do is put a membrane from over this, air, this clay pipe to this. I don't want to clean this up. It takes too much time, too much trouble to clean this up, remove this pipe, put the, maybe a cap. That's a lot of expenses on this. Here's what I do. I cut. I cut this section away, chop it off with a hammer, and this becomes more flat, and I put my membrane over this to the other side. So let me show you how I do it. Louis, come and take a video. So I use a grinder. I just bought a, a Milwaukee cordless one. It works so nice. Let me show you. I always use protection. And then um, I cut just to the other end. how I get this nice and even and I put uh, some tar in here and I put my membrane over this and I cover it I'll show you how I cover it so this is a pre-cut membrane yep remove the plastic uh, let's do the straight edge on the top and uh, flip it around this way take that up there there you go and what I do is I put this all the way there, okay? Remove the plastic. Get the torch here for me. Remove the plastic all the way. I have a striker. I don't have a striker. Um, let's just get it on the top. I smell something burning. Brakes? Breaks, eh? Mm -hmm. Not from us, right? No, no, no. no. <laughs> okay. We don't need it. <laughs> Start at the top. Put it all away. The there you go. So, Lewis tried it. Put it there, put it there. Okay. Not, not on the rib, just, just in the side of the rib. Yeah. Make sure. Yeah. That's what I do. Just a little bit more, Lewis. This one is not going. There you go. A little bit more. Just like that. See? Okay, good. So that's what I do. A little bit too long. Okay. Yeah, because it's too far now. All right, so that's good. So I got it all lined up, and I take a torch. This is right. I give it to you. Give me two. No, you put it down there. I got it. No, no. They already stick. 
ya se, ya se pegó eso. the bottom do the same thing Just like that. See that? And this will never, never ever leak. Right? That's it. So that's how I'll make the transition from a parapet wall to a roof that has those clay caps on it. And I tell you, it's a a very good method I've used it many times and it works very good so and that's it all right so we started this job yesterday and we've done it's not a pretty job because of the roof that was existing here was very rough but everything is much better than ever before the walls are covered we covered the walls with a membrane and you can see we cut the we cut this half and then we stick this in here and then we covered the walls here walls had tar before and I don't know what the paint so we made the transition here we covered the chimney see the chimney is covered everything is clean nice and the roof is a tight very tight this is never gonna leak again for the next 40 years so not a clean job but it's a job that any owner can do, anybody can do it. It's a peeler stick. The, the little bit of hard is the transitions to a wall or to a, a, a parapet wall. That is what makes it a little bit harder. You have to work at it. But the rest was so simple and easy. Anyway, I'm the flat roof doctor. I know a thing or two because I've seen a thing or two. Now, you're going to find some roofing guy who says, well, I'm an idiot the way I did it. I know, comments come and they think they know much better. Well, depends on the price, depends on what the negotiation is, what the owner wants, that's what you see. Not because that's what I want to do. If I want to do it my way, I'll strip the roof and redo everything. But, you know, you get these, uh, I would say low class guys, and they use cuss words on, this, uh, on their comments and they, they they don't have class. Don't worry about those comments. This is a roof that's going to last a long time. Anyway, just wanted to help you make your own, uh, how you can do your own roof without having to spend a lot of money. Okay, dokies. Have a good day. Please subscribe. And you can see where we're at. There's Lowe's. See Lowe's? And uh, we are done. <laughs>